Now you've heard about how the Modi Sarkar made a U-turn with the rail price hike. But wait till you listen to this if you haven't already. It's a story we put out first here on Headlines Today. Yesterday, Arun Jaitley, when he was leader of the opposition, had said the Henderson Brooks report, a secret war report on India's crushing defeat in the 1962 war, must be declassified. It must be put out in the open. But now as Defence Minister, he's actually told Parliament he doesn't believe it is ready for declassification just yet. Huge 180-degree U-turn by the Defence Minister, and we caught it first here on Headlines today. Take a look. It's the BJP's first big U-turn since it's come to power. The government said today that a report into India's failings in the 1962 war will remain secret, despite earlier calls from BJP members to declassify it. In March this year, Arun Jaitley, who was then the Rajya Sabha opposition leader, called for the release of the Brooks Bhagat report. Today, he did a U-turn. The Henderson Brooks report was an exercise aimed at analysing just what went wrong militarily. Politics behind the war was not a part of its mandate. However, a lot of politics has been played out over this report. In March 2014, when historian and journalist Neville Maxwell put out what he claimed were parts of this confidential report, Arun Jaitley, that time the leader of opposition in the Rajya Sabha, wrote this on his blog, which is still on the Bharatiya Janata Party website. He says, among everything else, with the wisdom of hindsight, I am of the opinion that the report's contents could have been made public some decades ago. This and today, in the Rajya Sabha, while replying to a question in a written format, he said, this is a top secret document and has not been declassified so far. Further release of this report fully or partially or disclosure of any information related to this report would not be in national interest. It does seem that in a span of four months, Mr. Jaitley has undertaken what can be called, and his critics are calling it that, a U-turn. The Congress reacted immediately, calling out the BJP for its earlier criticism. It was Narendra Modi ji who used to say, Dr. Manmohan Singh doesn't speak. Whether you have heard uh, Mr. Modi is speaking on any issue, so they have taken complete U-turn. And basically, they are following so many UPS policies. Ironically, some BJP leaders continue to call for the report's release. If you have a document, you will know what you have done. What you have done is that you have done. What you have done is that you have done. 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 So, you have done. You have done. You have done. The 1962 war report by Lieutenant General Henderson Brooks and Brigadier Bhagat has remained a secret for five decades. Many believe it's an attempt to protect those in charge of the government and military at the time. Defence experts have repeatedly called for its release so that future generations of Indian leaders can learn from the mistakes. So release it to the public and it is not really anything would go after 50 years old. What would happen? Uh, it is something that the people of India should know about. It is a sad day in our history, what happened then. Not only in the fact that we faced a defeat in the, in, 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 from, but in the way that the, the, the actual establishment, the whole structure functioned. For now, Arun Jaitley, like the Congress predecessors he criticized, believes it's in India's national interest that this does not happen. With Jugal Purohit, Pierre Fitter for Headlines Today.